what's up everyone? I'm Jeff Teague at Fred Anderson Toyota. We are your complete Toyota resource. Today we're gonna to talk about accessories, specifically how to accessorize, how to customize, how to make a Tundra your own. There are really four different ways or places where you can accessorize your vehicle. You can do it from the factory. You can do it at the regional assembly point, at the dealership level, and then maybe aftermarket. That can either be with an aftermarket company or it could be yourself doing it at home. This particular 2021 Toyota Tundra TRD Sport has many options added to it. Several are at the dealership level. We did that ourselves. Several of them are at the regional port level. You can have them done there or those same options you can have a dealership add. So let's see what Fred Anderson added and then we'll look at the port level as well. I'll also show you a couple different factory options and packages. This particular truck right here is a 2021 SR5 4x4 Crew Max in magnetic gray. It has had the SR5 upgrade package on it from the factory, the TRD Sport Package Plus upgrade, and the TRD Sport Convenience Package added to it. You can already see some ways that a stock Tundra has been upgraded. So let's start there. An SR5 Tundra is going to have fabric seats, but when we add them at the dealership level, now you can get your choice of colors, genuine leather, upgrade. This is the two-tone, where it's an ash gray along with black. It's cat skin leather. Usually two rows of seats is anywhere between, say, $12.99 and $14.99, depending on the vehicle for two rows of seats. And then we'll look, remember this is a Crew Max, so it has a gigantic back seat. But just look how the whole vibe of the vehicle changes when you add in leather seats. They're easy to clean, they last a long time. They're beautiful looking. Two other options on the inside of the truck. Number one, heated seats. Go in a nice convenient spot there where you can do high heat or low heat or off and then we've got a wireless charging station and how smart is this it's actually built right into the center console area so that way it's a nice wide space so your iphone or android or other phone can charge without wires impressive the next option that we added is the locking tailgate actuator Works in combination with your keyless entry, just like that. It'd be really good if you had a hard shell top here, that way you can lock stuff in. And then you can start to see the spray in bed liner. I'll tell more about that later. The next option we have is right here, we've got LED bed lights. Seems like that would come in very handy when you've got a hard shell top or just really looking in at nighttime. Now this also has the spray in bed liner added to it. Start to see an easy way to protect the paint, the bed of your truck. No more scrapes, no more dings, no more dents. No more scrapes. Another option we added, it's a small one, but an important one, wheel locks. So you can see down here, each of the wheels has one wheel lock on it to make it a lot tougher for people to steal vehicles. Hey, speaking of wheels and tires. Sometimes vehicles change appearance multiple times within the same vehicle. Normally on an SR5 4x4 Crew Max, you're gonna get 18 inch wheels. The Sport Plus package has an upgrade of 20 inch alloy wheels on it. But at the regional port, they added 22 inch KMC wheels with performance sport tires. So you can see how the look has drastically changed and changed and changed. With technology becoming more and more prevalent and important in people's lives, or at least a majority of people's lives, you might see the need for more connectivity how about adding rear USB ports, rear charging ports to really a Tundra, or you can add it to a Tacoma or a Camry 
or an Avalon or really any type of vehicle, a RAV4. But that way people in the back aren't gonna fight with people in the front for the remaining ports. Rear USB, baby. The next option that we added at the dealership is window tinting. Window tinting, of course, looks great. It also keeps the vehicle cooler and it keeps sun out of people's eyes a little bit more than others. And you can see right here, there's a little seam between the top. So you can see where it's had the window tinting. That might be an option for you. And of course, depending on where you do it, you can do different styles different specs and different percentages of tint to make it lighter or darker, depending on what you want in your state's guidelines. You may choose to black out your logos, your emblems, black emblem overlays. Of course, with the Tundra logo, you'll see it on the side with the Tundra logo. And we've also got the 5.7 liter badge, iForce, blacked out. What do you think? Are you someone who likes the chrome badging better or do you like the blacked out badging better? Let's look underneath the truck now so you can see what's been done exhaust wise. We've got this Borla dual exhaust system set up. Of course, it looks fantastic. And it has the black tip at the end and it makes that muscular, powerful growl. With a truck as big as a Tundra, you may want to add a little bit of extra help getting up into the vehicle. You could use these Predator Pro step bars, or maybe you could do running boards. They can be black matte ones. They can be glossy ones. They can be chrome faced ones. Your choice, your style. Either way, it helps you get a leg up, so to speak. Now the window sticker is gonna show us what's been added at the factory, the regional port and the dealership level. So let's look at that. Made in San Antonio, Texas. It starts off as an SR5 Crew Max, and then we're gonna build it from there. We're going transformer style. Here's the fuel mileage. Let's look at standard features first of all. 5.7 liter, 381 horsepower, 401 pounds of torque, six-speed automatic transmission. Toyota Safety Sense it has on it. There's those 18 inch wheels that were stock. Okay. Now, factory MSRP is 411. We're gonna see the price and the options jump up pretty quickly. Deck rail system, you probably saw that when we were looking at the spray in bed liner. The TRD Sport Package Plus adds in the upgraded wheels, but we've gone past that. It's got the Sport Tune Bilstein shock absorbers, anti-sway bars, color keyed grill surround, all that stuff there. We've got LED fog lights. So now let's keep going all the way down. We've got the SR5 upgrade package, which gives the 38 gallon fuel tank, the bucket seats, a lot going on there too. And then the sport convenience package, that's front and rear parking sonar, blind spot monitor, rear cross traffic alert. So now we're gonna take that. We've got a lot of options. So with delivery and processing and handling, 48.5. Let's upgrade some more. We're gonna add in those extra wheels and tires, the dual exhaust, Predator Pro step bars, then the black overlays, tailgate insert, LED interior light package. We did not look at that one specifically, but you take the yellow halogen bulbs and switch them over to the cool white lights. Then it has paint protection along the door seam as well. So now we're gonna get up to a five and a three, I'll bet. Just a hunch. There we go, 53,244, but we've got more. This is what's been added at the dealership level. There's a twist at the end. It's got interior protectant, exterior paint protectant, the window tinting, spray and bed liner, wheel locks, the leather and heated seats, wireless charging, tailgate actuar, actuator, LED bed lights, and rear dual USBs. Puts it at 58,265. Fred Anderson Toyota, home of the free family plan. 
Thank you everyone so much for watching. We hope the video was helpful. We'd love it if you left a comment to say hi or tell us which options, which upgrades, which packages are most beneficial to you. Which ones did you like? Which ones would you leave off? What did you think of that dual exhaust? Pretty cool, right? All right. So thank you again so much. We really appreciate it. We'd love it if you followed our other social media platforms. You'll see a picture of this bad boy here on Instagram at Fred Anderson Toyota. Also, we're on Facebook, Fred Anderson Toyota. And then check out our hundreds of cars, trucks, and SUVs. We love it when you check our inventory. We may have something that you like. We may have something that you like that's incoming. You can see it here, fredandersontoyota.com. Thanks everyone so much, and we'll see you next time.